have is uh, smoking with Scruggs here. Yeah. Um, got a big wing ding going on this weekend. Uh, my son's birthdays, and uh, we're having a cookout for him. He's having some friends over. So, um, Ben's is his birthday. Well, first, let me tell you this I'm going to tell you a story. It might be a little lengthy, but, but it, it gets into some stuff. Um, people that I work for, they, they travel a lot. They go all over the place. They do a lot of cruises, and they actually worked for a race series that, that traveled the whole country. And anyway, they would always, you know, I like hot stuff, so they would always bring me back um, a bottle of hot sauce. Well, anyway, one time they went up to Buffalo, New York, for um, for an indie race up there, and uh, and um, they uh, they forgot to get something, so they went to the airport, and they just picked up this stuff, um, and bought it on back, and I tried it, and I was like, oh my gosh, this is the best stuff I've ever tasted in my whole life. Well, I used to buy this stuff when I first started um, grilling wings. Um, this was what I used all the time and uh, I didn't you know I, everybody knew what it was you know I didn't tell them that it was mine and you know it was my recipe but I have tried to make stuff um, you know that, that comes close to this and I I never have well I used to buy this stuff um, in four gallon cases it was so good and it got to be where you know the shipping on this stuff has gotten so outrageous that I haven't bought it in years. But being it's my son's birthday, um, and he really likes this. He doesn't like he likes my recipe, but he really likes this. Um, I sprung and bought a gallon of it. And to be honest with you, I think it's the uh, the best wing sauce on the planet. But you have to have a pretty hot palate. Um, I'm gonna show you what it is and then I'll kind of give you the history behind this place um, some people probably have been there before I never have and I'd like to go there one day but um, supposedly is the birthplace of, of um, chicken wings you know wings wing dings whatever you want to call them. but this is the sauce that I got and we're um, I'll, I'll tell you how we're gonna do our wings and everything but I'm just I'll give you a shot of this stuff and show you what it is. It's uh places in Buffalo, New York. And it's uh Anchor Bar is the name of the bar. And uh it's suicidal hot wing sauce. Now supposedly um this is where chicken wings um originated at this restaurant. Um and uh, you can go to that website. Well, actually, you know what I'll do? I'll put the website where you can buy this stuff if you want to buy some. Um, and uh, um, you can go there and check the story out. But supposedly it was a bunch of bunch of guys, you know. So the the the, the mother who ran the place um, made some some wings and just whipped this stuff together for her son and some of his friends, I believe and uh, kind of like history was made um, but this stuff is the bomb I mean it's probably the greatest wing sauce in the world in my opinion just my opinion but um, basically all we're going to do is we're going to put chicken wings in the bag and I'm not going to show you all this because this is you know this it's just everybody knows how to put chicken in a bag and we're just going to pour this sauce in the bag and we're just going to marinate them overnight. Now I'm doing some other wings and um, I'm taking the recipe from the competition wing thighs and what I'm doing is I'm making the dry rub I'm gonna put the dry rub on the wings and I'm gonna marinate them overnight. I'm also going to make the um, the baste from that recipe and I'm going to baste the wings tomorrow on uh, on the grill so what I'm planning on doing with these um, we have a bunch of other stuff hamburgers hot dogs and all that and uh, some veggie burgers for those that are vegetarian 
Um, but I'm planning on smoking these for about an hour and then I'm going to uh, if everything works right this is I'm, I'm gonna put coals in my grill and then I'm gonna char them up a little bit on the outside so that they're real crunchy now on the, the suicidals I just take them right out the bag and just throw them on the grill that's all I do so it's pretty simple and like I say I'm gonna try that recipe from the competition thighs I'm not gonna do any any um, basting as far as in the sauce I'm just using the dry rub and then I'm going to use the uh, the glaze not the base the glaze is what I want to make I'm going to make the glaze so you can get that recipe I'm going to do it I'm going to do the ones that that I did because I really like that because I I didn't have barbecue sauce and I used the ketchup and the Worcestershire that's the one I'm using on these wings and um, so tomorrow we'll get everything set up and I'll um, take some film of these bad boys for you Thanks a lot. Okay, what's up? Uh, just got the wings on. Um, just kind of wanted to show you. Uh, I just threw the smoke, smoking chips on, and uh, just kind of wanted to show you what this sauce looked like on these wings. This stuff is just like unreal. Um, so I'm, I'm gonna let you take a peek, and then I'm just gonna close it down real quick. Um, there we go. Some of the smoke to clear. Yeah, look at the spices on that stuff. That's really good. Yeah, that's that suicide. And I'll tell you what, it's going to be good. I'm going to shut it down now because I'm going to lose all my heat. But, there we go. I'm gonna try to maintain try to maintain about 250 275 I'm gonna smoke these for about an hour I'm gonna get the firebox hot jack um, and uh, yeah we'll smoke them about an hour and I'm just gonna throw them on a, I'm excited if I'm gonna just throw them on a Weber or I might just try to uh, to grill them on this char grill, just do it all on one. We'll see, play by ear. All right, thanks for watching. Got some glazed over there, and the suicidal ones over there. And we'll see what they taste like here in a little bit. Well, I know what they could taste like, so, but good deal. Yeah, I finished them off over here. Kind of just set my little grill up. And just finished them all off. Had problems with it, but oh well. Didn't get to film everything because it was just too much going on. Alrighty, we'll do a taste test in a minute. Eating my suicidal wings, and they're just like I remember them. Y'all really need to get get some of this. I'll go down to put the link in the video. Stroke the bomb. And try his glazed one. 
see what this glazed one tastes like. That's a winner too. Yep. I say both of these are a header. I'll put the recipe down in the links again. Basically, I just use for the glazed ones. Same recipe that I used with the chicken thighs. I just didn't baste them. Alright, thanks for watching. Keep on grilling. Mm. Yeah, I'll go.